हियर आई कंसिडर सिंपल प्रोग्राम एडिशन ऑफ टू नंबर्स बाय यूजिंग क्लास एंड ऑब्जेक्ट सो सिंपल सी प्लस प्लस प्रोग्राम फॉर एडिशन ऑफ टू नंबर्स हियर वी विल सी हाउ टू क्रिएट ए क्लास एंड हाउ टू क्रिएट एन ऑब्जेक्ट हाउ वी कैन एक्सेस द क्लास एंड ऑब्जेक्ट ऑल वी आर गोइंग टू बी सींग इन द प्रोग्राम by seeing the program you can come to know what is a class and what is a object and how you are going to be accessing all that you can come to know this is very easy and simple program by using c++ we will see now so here uh, first uh, you need to include the header file hash #include pre uh, hash #include iostream dot h hash is nothing but here this is nothing but a pre processor direct to this pre uh, it tells the pre processor to include the header file iostream dot h next you need to declare the class so already i said i am going to be doing the addition of two numbers by using class so uh, you need to mention the class class can be declared by using the class name so class class name i considered as a addition next Uh, open the flower base variables you can declare so int x comma y here public uh, i mentioned what are the access specifiers why i mentioned later you can come to know all that um, i will explain in the another video next add function add function body i am uh, writing here itself so whenever you are writing the function body no semicolon okay next see out uh, this is nothing but a um if you want to print anything on the output screen see out you need to mention next one this is nothing but a insertion operator so if you want to print anything on the output screen in uh, c++ you need to mention see out insertion operator and within the double quotes whatever you want to print on the output screen that you need to write addition of two numbers next one again insertion operator i want to do addition of two numbers so x plus y i mentioned otherwise you can mention some int z z is equal to x plus y z also you can write here no problem next one addition uh, close function body is closed here next here you observe this class i opened here this class is closed here with a semicolon next one main function uh, every program will be having some main function here so here main function i have written next open the flower base next one uh, for the class i need to create an object so this is a class it doesn't allocate any memory until and unless you create an object so i created object now so it is created um, it is allocated memory for the class so how to create an object class name space object name this is my class name and object name anything you can give a i have given class name space object name semicolon next what i said by using object name you can access the class variables and class methods with the dot operator so object name dot class variable name or member name what is the class variable name x so here i did not declare any variable values here x is equal to 10 y is equal to 20 like that i did not declare anything here so by using that object i want to declare so a dot x is equal to 10 here if you want to mention x is equal to 10 y is equal to 20 also you can mention no problem so, but by using object i want to declare so here a dot x is equal to 10 and a dot y is equal to 20 which is nothing but object name dot member name is equal to value object name dot variable name is equal to value semicolon next by using this object only you can call the function which is nothing but a object name a dot function name add function name close next one main function uh, should ends with a return zero next return zero this is closed here uh open the brace close main function is closed here so whenever you execute this program every uh, program here starts with a uh, main function okay execution starts with a main function so here you created an object so allocating x value as a 10 y value is a 10 tree and it is going to be calling the function add so it is go it will go to the add function in the add function what you mentioned addition of two numbers is so it is going to be printing on the output screen as a addition of two numbers is and again insertion operator x plus y so the result of x plus y will be printed on the output screen x plus y is nothing but a 30 this is nothing but a simple c++ program 
uh, for addition of two numbers you can write like this also another way also i am going to be explaining so here same header files you need to include next class class name next up directly in the public uh, i am going to be declaring some variables and with values and function name next this function i have written here but function body i did not mention in the class so whenever you are not writing the function body um, you need to close the semicolon here return type should be there for any function so if you did not mention anything return type for the function means by default it is going to be considering as a int anyway by default it will consider int so i did not mention any return type so here class class name access specify next int x is equal to 10 y is equal to 20 int add function next this class is closed here okay this class is closed whenever this function body you need to write now so whenever you need to write the function body outside of the class then you need to follow the syntax return type of the function what is the return type of the function here int so if you write or not it does it will consider by default as a int only so return type class name what is the class name addition is the class name so class name scope resolution function name so return type what is the return type here function return type class name scope resolution function name next open the brace next i see out addition of two numbers is x plus y same as this code i have written next for this function body is closed next one main here also for the main function i did not return anything here so by default it is consider it will consider as a int whenever you mentioned in uh, int uh, mentioned or not mentioned it consider as a integer int only so here if you mention void you did not mention any return statement here okay that is the condition you need to remember next one main function uh, addition a for this nothing but a for the class you are going to be creating an object by using that object you are going to be calling the function so by using this object it is going to be calling the function add here what you mentioned addition of two numbers is x plus y already i declared x is equal to 10 y is equal to 20 so it is going to be returning addition of two numbers is 30 like this okay next one return zero success uh, whenever the program is successfully completed operating system return will return zero to the main function so you need to mention return state zero this is the simple c plus plus program for addition of two numbers it's better to remember 